to squad. Box check. Repeat. Kill team leader to squad. Confirm Vox contact. We have crashed. It's from your position. Do you have the virus bomb? Damn it. Served your emperor well, brother. Record log. To any Imperial unit that recovers this log, my kill team crash landed off course. My brothers are all dead. Slain by Tyranids. I have the virus bomb. Moving to the orbital launcher. We'll fire into stratosphere where it will disperse over Tyranid positions. Inserting payload. Authorization. Set course for stratospheric detonation. The right of safeguard must be performed. Seek an authorized command console. Copy. 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 Copy.
is the Emperor. <clears throat> the wound was fatal. You survived only through the Rubicon surgery. We remade you. You are a Primaris now. Why? Lord Kalgar issued the command himself. Is he here? Gone. Summoned by the Primarch. I must get back to the Watch Fortress. You have been reassigned. My place is with the Death Watch. The Inquisition can find no stain on you, Titus. Accused of heresy. You have served penance in the Death Watch for almost a century. And not once have you faltered. But you will never know redemption until you have faced the judgment of your brothers. Prove yourself to us and no true absolution. What is your life? My honor is my life. What is your fate? My duty is my fate. What is your fear? My fear is to fail. What is your reward? My salvation is my reward. What is your craft? My craft is death. What is your pledge? My pledge is eternal service. Surgery has remade you as a Primaris Marine. You are now stronger, faster, and more resilient. You will take your place as an Ultramarine once more. Your brothers will know that you served in the Death Watch, but your dishonorable status as a Black Shield has been redacted from the Archives. Should it be discovered, there would be... questions. Lord Kalgar has offered you a second chance. Do not taint it. My lord. Lieutenant Titus reporting for duty. Have Sergeant Gadriel report to the bridge. Good enough. I'll be straight with you, Titus. I have my reservations about your reinstatement. There could be questions, suspicions. I cannot afford discord among the men. Not now. You're a lieutenant now. Will that be a problem? No, Captain. Very well. We're facing a Tyranid splinter fleet. They engaged us on two planets. Avarax, a hive world, and Kadaku, which you already know. We're abandoning the latter. It's mostly Adeptus Mechanicus research facilities. We're evacuating critical assets and personnel. These defense guns are keeping the skies clear for our ships. The Tyranids have taken note. Get down there and protect those guns. Captain, you wish to see me? Sergeant, this is Lieutenant Titus. He'll be taking over command of your squad. Sir, I, I expect you on the ground within 30 minutes. Dismissed.
You served in the Death Watch? Yes. That must have been a great honor. It's a privilege to serve with you. Approaching drop zone! Let's go! See those service studs? Our lieutenant is over 200 years old. He couldn't have been born a Primaris. <clears throat> You're right. And now he has your command. Major, give me an update. The wretched beasts have taken the orbital guns. They pushed us back to this encampment and are staging a heavy assault. Illyrio, take Alterius and Elion and remain here to secure the encampment. Yes, brother. Major, we must reach the defense guns. Yes, my lord. Follow me. through the jungle to reach the orbital defense guns. Brother Lirio, assist the Cadians while they establish new defensive lines and then report back. Yes, Lieutenant. They will not take long. ship so big you can fly a frigate through it it won't let that happen without a fight it's the hive mind the tyranid's powerful collective intelligence not to be underestimated major the guns are in a zero state of charge it will take time to wake the machine spirit hurry the tyranids will throw everything they have at this facility This is Major Sarkana. Divert 2nd and 3rd platoon to the orbital guns immediately. Copy that, sir. Let's show these bastards what the 8th are made of! Lieutenant, Captain Akaran has new orders for you. Very well. Where is Elian? The enemy tried to smother us. We got separated. By the time we had slain the attackers, Elian was dead. Something put a hole clean through his helmet. I should have been with you. I only wish he had lived to see that hive ship burn. I fought beside Elian for two decades. 
He could not have been defeated by Hormigans. There are creatures more deadly than Hormigons down there. You should not have let our squad be divided. He is gone, Sergeant. Duty is all. I do not forget my brother so quickly. Lieutenant, I was informed you arrived with Lord Kalga. Did you fight with him on Vigilus? I've read through those battle reports more than a hundred times. A masterful defense. My duty kept me busy elsewhere. You have an unusual service record. That is my good fortune. I want a scout recon of that position. Captain, get over here. Captain, I have the Mechanicus on Vox. They can wait. This is Nozick Beta 12, a Mechanicus Archmagos. He should have been aboard this ship an hour ago, but he refuses to leave Kodaku without some data from his lab. He's currently in this Imperial Guard base. His facility is here. The enemy is closing in. That base will be overrun imminently. Nozick is a high-value asset. Get that data and get him out. The mining facility. If we rupture the staging tanks, direct the flow into the valley. We can ignite the fields around the base. Boil them in Prometheum. I'll give you command of a small team to hit the staging tanks. Three men. That's all I can spare. Brief them immediately. Yes, Captain. Well, well. Lieutenant Titus. We are told you have need of us, brother. My squad must recover data from a Mechanicus research facility in Sector 41A. A large enemy swarm threatens to overrun both that facility and an Imperial Guard base to its east. You will sabotage a Prometheum refinery to delay their advance. We will not fail you, Lieutenant. Let us burn the Xenos filth. Time is short. I will brief you on descent. Brother, Magos Galio wishes to see you in the armory. Noted. If you have not been issued a pyroblaster for this task, then get one from the armory immediately. We must burn any biohazards clinging to the fuselage before the fight is in the center of the craft in quite some time, Titus. You requested my presence. How are you acclimating to your new status? I have no complaints. Intriguing. Predictions would determine a point nine probability that you would. I have pressing duties, Magos. Very well. Engage the armory terminal. I will see that you are suitably equipped for your mission. Brother Titus, you leave on a mission of vital importance. The battlefield below leaves no room for the slightest error of judgment. I am of clear mind and purpose. May the directives of our beloved Primarch guide your every action. I shall follow your progress closely. I will reflect on your words, Chaplain. But for now, duty calls. Makos, for the last time, we must get you off world! The assessment equals in all in the ignorance. We'll be overrun in minutes! By the Omnisimer cease interruptions. Major. Ah, Akron finally sends me what I asked for. Arch Magos, it is imperative you evacuate immediately. Detroit will not leave without the data. Relocate to my facility. I will instruct over Vox. Meg ready to leave. This will not take long. Major. I have a second unit working on a theoretical that should buy you some time. My lord! I've lost three squads trying to reach that lab. We think something's out there. Noted. The Emperor protects.
Major Sarkana, you were correct. There was a lictor out here. I suspect you have already dealt with it. Indeed. It will not trouble you again. Very good, my lord. Analysis. Transmission active. Data incoming. Denied. Classified. Uh, leave such matters to me. Report. Transmission complete. Your assistance is no longer required. Major Sarkana, please escort Nozick to the Thunderhawk and get him off world. Yes, my lord. With pleasure. I shall be glad to be rid of these trivial duties. As I will be glad to cease the flapping of this repugnant flesh voice. Time to go. This elevator goes to the rooftop. Archmagus, confirm receipt of data stream. This is Lirio. Transmission received. Nozick is on the Thunderhawk. Standing by. Get him out of here! Yes, sir. Major Sarkana, what's your status? We've lost a lot of men, a lot of heavy loads, but we're still in the fight! We're coming to you now. Nozick, will they hit? Lirio, do you read me? Major, did you see what happened? No idea! We saw no impact! That is territory claimed by the swarms. We need to reach him, fast. There was an armoring chamber below. Jump packs. Sir! The guardsmen. With respect, my lord! We're Cadians! We can take care of ourselves! did this is long gone. Gadriel, 
Then where did Dimitri and Titus serve previously? And why is he back in battle so soon after such grievous surgery? Sergeant Venti had spoke of a Death Watch team that deployed a virus bomb on Kadaku. Perhaps our lieutenant was one of them. I am far more concerned with what we just saw at that crash site. Lieutenant. Brother, are you recovered? I am. The apothecary should run a diagnostic. I do not have the need nor the time for such a process. Magos Gallio also expressed his concern. Consider his counsel, if not ours. If there is any risk of recurrence, it puts the whole squad in jeopardy. It can wait. I must speak with Captain Akaran. As you command. Serve him. With our bodies, our blood, and our searing wrath. Our very life force is a gift from him. And we shall use it to serve him only. For he is the light of mankind. His is the one truth in a galaxy of falsity and horror. Those that defy his will shall be cut down in swathes. Their armies crushed. Their tainted lands burned to ash and their wretched kind eradicated from existence. Now, go forth and lay waste to the Xenos Plague in the name of the Emperor. Archmagos will not be regarded favorably by the machine cult. The fault is theirs. Their own reports. Brother, it is a relief to see you on your feet. Anyway, Heard you took a turn for the worse. Such reports were exaggerated. I am glad to hear it. Your efforts in delaying the swarm were admirable. It was a sight to behold, brother. I must report to Agaran. Excuse me. The Emperor protects. And damnation happened down there. Nozick was assassinated. The Adeptus Mechanicus report said engine failure. That's not what I saw. Sergeant. Traitors. Chaos. You're sure? No mistaking it, sir. Clear the bridge! Nozick was head of a highly classified project. Aurora. What is it? A weapon. And the minions of Chaos learned of its existence. With Nozick dead, there's only one man capable of continuing the work. Morius Luz. Nozick's apprentice. He is currently missing. His last known location was a Mechanicus facility on Avarax. One that is now overrun with Tyranids. This will get you into the cogitator within the facility. You can access Luz's tracker from there. We are on course to Avarax now. I want you ready the second we enter orbit. Sir. What was on the ship with Nozick? What concern is it of yours? The Mechanicus seemed eager to retrieve it. And yet the enemy left it untouched. Whatever it is, without Luz, is useless to us. Lieutenant, the journey to Avarax will take time. Enough for a brief diagnostic. Very well, if it will put you at ease. Megas Gallio will be in the armory. How 
What did you know about Aurora? I saw the name in a mission report, most of which was redacted. I would have preferred to stay in Kadaku and hunt down the heretics that dishonored our brothers. We will find them on Abrax. Unless Luz is already dead. Whatever those tech priests are working on is still here, in this system. I expect the greatest battle is yet to come. Titus. I heard that you collapsed upon encountering the tainted wreckage. I am concerned. A mere side effect of the surgery. I am fully recovered. Sergeant Gadriel, I trust that you will be close at hand should your brother suffer any further episodes. Yes, Brother Chaplin. If the arch enemy is indeed present, any weakness could grow into a cancer of the soul. Bind yourself to the pages of the Codex, and it will shield you from the glare of heresy. My faith is without compromise. I will not waver. This is as close as I can get you. You will need to take the cargo elevator from here. Fox in when you're ready to leave. Understood. My thanks, brother. The lab is within that spire. There's the cargo elevator. Look at all those spores. That'll be one hell of a fight. Shame to miss it. We should be down there with the rest of the company. We will be soon enough. Lieutenant Titus, Ultramarines, Second Company. Enter your command. Locate Marius Luz. Access denied. Access rights granted. Establishing locus. Abarax. The city. Temple of Thassian. Vitals are elevated. Our box for a Thunderhawk. Wait. Open file project, Aurora. Register intention and requisition. Open the file. Open file reconstruction. Brother, those are classified. Destroyed. Mechanicus falls. Display current location of artifact. Warning. Volkite reactor unstable. Meltdown imminent. This whole place will collapse onto the city beneath us. Get them off the core! Backup generators have been awakened. No essential systems returning to hibernation. No sign of Tyranids. The smell of burnt eye core is enough. We have what we came for. Move to the extraction zone. Lieutenant, what did you see in those Mechanicus files? A record of extreme foolishness. Explain. You may direct that request to our captain. Give me a tactical overlay of the city. Captain! A minute. The Adeptus Mechanicus must be stopped. What? If they trigger the weapon, the results could be catastrophic. And what makes you suddenly an expert on Mechanicus research? They're using an artifact to power the weapon. I've seen it before, on a planet named Gryia. A traitor by the name of Nemroth called it a fragment of the Dark God's power. It almost destroyed the planet. Gryia. 
Titus. The Mechanicus are acting on orders approved by the Primarch. And here are you, talking of Gryia, of all places. Damn it, Captain. If chaos is here, if they get their hands on this thing... Enough! I will hear no more on the subject. Now, did you get a location for Luz? Aye, sir. Then get down there and find him! There are those who would see you sent back to the Inquisition. Tread carefully, brother. Damn them. After everything that happened. Brother, do not keep us in the dark. It is not your concern. You criticize the captain for withholding intelligence. And yet you treat us to the same evasive obscurity. Stray words have cost me dearly. So you do not trust us? Brothers, calm yourselves, lest you face the chaplain's censure. Look! Time to go. I will not concede another loss to our enemies. Brother, you seem troubled. I tire of reckless fools. I hope you do not mean us. Not unless you worship the Omnisire. Ah, then I share your distaste. Located inside the dome section of the city. We'll have to land outside and make our approach. Thank you. Nice Lock armor. Nothing gets across with that beast up there. What are we up against? It has its rear covered and we do not have the manpower to break through. The Cadians are holding the bridge. At great cost. Set up assault positions by the bridge. We'll deal with the Neurothrop. Very well. We will avenge them, brother. Watch yourself. Brothers. Sergeant, good to see you. The Cadians have the bridge under control. Thought you could use an extra hand. A welcome offer. Climb on. The temple is this way. Lieutenant, the Cadians are requesting support. Go. Thank you, brother. Ultramarines! Have the enemy infiltrated the dome? No, my lord. What about the Temple of Thassian? The dome was evacuated days ago. Rejoin the main force immediately. Our orders are to remain here. On whose authority? Captain Fairburn. We are to hold this position until further notice. The dome is empty. Now move on. 
But, sire... I gave you an order. Forgive me, my lord. Perhaps there was a communication error. The captain insisted. The deserters. No, no, no. We have our orders. Box your captain. If you are deserters, I'll execute you myself. Captain Fairburn, come in. Captain Fairburn, come in. Ambush! Sergeant, check the perimeter. Yes, brother. Explain yourself. Need I justify my hatred? You need justify your recklessness. The traitors have a debt to me. And you will throw away your life to collect? Death is my duty! Your duty is to the Emperor. You will die when and where he so chooses, not over some personal vendetta. Do you understand? Lieutenant, you should see this. some kind of shield. The altars. Same ones we encountered earlier. They must generate the shield. Destroy them. Then purge these abominations from the face of this world. Lance of Jove. Stand by for extraction. Affirmative. In the name of the Emperor, open the doors! Mori is loose. I owe you my existence. Come with us. To where? The battle barge. Compliance, but I must speak with Archmagus Nozick at once. He's dead. Dead? You are to replace him. Uh, Lose.
my source. It's dangerous. I have spent my life studying it. I assure you it's quite safe. In the right hands. Arrogance. Arrogance. Why must the Mechanicus meddle with the unknown? We follow the will of the Omnisire. Go ahead. Titus, report to Captain Acheron immediately on arrival. Confirmed. Titus? A Captain Titus was killed on the forge world of Graia over a century ago. He died holding the power source in his hands. Not even an, an Astartes could survive power of that magnitude. Morius Luz, come with me. Disagree. That is your right. Brother, we only want to help you. Help? You almost cost us the mission, and now you speak of help. Lord. Heretic Astartes. They're showing up in every hive city on Avarax. We're already overstretched by the Tyranids. The traitors have us off guard. The Adeptus Mechanicus tell me Aurora is ready. They say the weapon will work. Sir, I know your concerns, Titus. But we may have no choice. Can we at least warn Kalgar of the danger? Impossible. The astropathic relay on Avarax has been completely surrounded. Every attempt we've made to break through the Telenet lines has failed. Can we Vox a message in? There's a dead zone around the relay. Something's interfering with our Vox comms. We have to get inside. Emperor, save me. I've tried. Now the Terranids have launched an attack on our defenses. We're pulling back to the fortress. We'll make our final stand there. Battlefield projection. Magnify C3. Where are you? There. The Hive Tyrant. We've had no reports. It's there. We kill it. We break the synaptic connection. It scatter like rats. A Hive Tyrant. A worthy adversary. And if you're wrong, if it's not there, I cannot afford to throw men after a hunch. Give me two squads. Two squads? We need to kill the Hive Tyrant, find whoever is jamming us, and get the message inside the relay. Six men. That's all I can spare. Use them wisely. Thank you. The Emperor protects. Titus, the Captain has put great faith in you with this mission. Should you reach the relay, your message to Lord Kalgar may determine the course of this war. Choose your words wisely. You doubt my intentions. It is your actions I will judge. I need not remind you of the consequences you suffered the last time. If you cannot trust in the will of the Primarch, then you are unfit for this duty. It seems I am not the only one on this ship with concerns about your intentions. It is the Chaplain's responsibility to ensure our chapter remains pure, not yours. Your erratic behavior is plain for all to see. And now, I find you have a history of it. I am doing my duty, as I was then, protecting a system from ruin. Ah, oh, there he is. 
this. Lieutenant, Gallio and I were just examining your recent diagnostic. Gallio, I object to such intrusions. As do I. But they are queries I must fulfill. I seek only answers. Your survival is a profound mystery that must be resolved. Such unbridled curiosity is the gateway to ruin. But that is where you are mistaken. Ruin is all around us, but I will soon depart for the Aurora facility on the Merium, and there I shall close all gateways to ruin permanently. You will see. Lieutenant, the squad is ready. We are yours to command, Lieutenant. The astropathic relay on Avarax is under direct assault. If it falls, so do our hopes of reinforcement. We will engage in a three-point operation to break the Xenos command, restore Vox, and secure the relay. We will not fail you. Not one of us can afford to fail this day. Prepare for deployment. I will transmit mission details on descent. It should be us facing the Hive Tyrant. Talasa can handle it. They have three men. We should be with them, but you have us playing courier. That message has to get through. And what exactly is that message? Speak your mind, brother. I searched the archives. You were once captain of the second company, and then you disappeared. Over a century ago, I was serving with the Death Watch. There would be records. Not for a Black Shield. A Black Shield? You would erase your chapter markings. I would die for these colors. Then why? I was accused. It was my penance. What were you accused of? Corruption. Brace for landing. Move out. Delta wing, box check. Meridian here. Still on our gunship. Talasa has landed, and soon a tyrant will fall. Acknowledged. Proceeding to relay. Maintain Vox reports. Damocles out. The Astropath relay is four miles from here. Expect heavy Tyranid presence. What of the arch enemy? Sporadic reports, but they are here. Damn right! For we are the Cadian Eight! The most fearsome, tenacious, and relentless bloody men! Then I'll trust that you You have disgraced yourselves by abandoning your brothers. Your punishment is dishonorable death. Blessed Emperor, I failed you. I beg of you that you forgive me. And we shall bring death to any that threaten the sacred soil of the Imperium.
It is not dead. Enlighten us, Lord Titus. The swarm would go feral without their connection to the hive mind, but their focus is still on the relay. Reports confirm the lieutenant's assessment. Enemy cohesion is still in full effect. That beast is not yet dead. Our word is bought. This void sport behemoth has seen its last day. We should turn around and regroup with the main force. Ties us to Resilient. Requesting Gamma Pattern Hammerfall Bunker on my location immediately. You need to jump. Request confirmed. Stand by. There's our entry. That's quite a shot. Damocles to Talassa. Report. If Talassa fails to take out the Hive Tyrant, then our little excursion was all for naught. with the main force. Why toil in obscurity when there's glory center stage? Hey, Sergeant. Our brothers are dying while we sneak around in the shadows. If we fail to send this message, we face a massacre. Lieutenant said it himself. There's deception at work. If you've got something to say, Sergeant. Tyrant was controlling these underlings via synaptic link. The turmoil you now see among the enemy can mean only one thing. The Hive Tyrant is dead. Viridian here. If you can hear this, Damocles, we got the bastards. Excellent work, brother. Any contact with Talassa? 
To lesser to Damocles. The alien contaminates our world no longer. Lieutenant Titus to relay. Area secure. Open the gates. message from Marnius Kalgar. I cannot help you. It's urgent. In addition to the shadow cast in the warp by the Tyranids, demonic forces are now poised to attack anyone who opens their minds to the warp. You would flee from your duty. I would have you know. <laughs> Give me your message. Let us begin. My lady, I must protest. The danger is too great. Silence. There are no guarantees. Titus. Chaos forces have been detected entering the system. They are going after Aurora. We are leaving for Demerium immediately. How did you know? I was a boy on Kalf when the word bearers attacked. 
I came to know the mark of chaos. We're returning to the battle barge. I understand your actions, but your suspicions end here. Are we clear? Yes, sir. Brothers, this is Aurora. Within the last few hours, traitor forces have arrived in their hundreds and commandeered the facility. Commandeered? Where is Luz? Inside. They have the facility, Luz, and the power source. Holy terror. Perhaps you were right, Titus. What's our theoretical? We've diverted all available forces to the Merium, but we're well below full strength. We've prepared an assault, but it has little chance of success, unless we take care of this. They're using it to draw in reinforcements. For every one of them we kill, two more show up in their place. It's heavily guarded. I'll need a combat squad, five men. I can spare three men. Next. The enemy seem to be drawing their power from this structure. What is it? We don't know. Every attempt to bring it down has failed. Your squad has developed a reputation for unconventional approaches. Any ideas? I've read of Demeria. It's a burial world. 4,000 years ago, there was a clash between the Ultramarines and the Heretics. The Sword of Atreus, a battle barge wrecked in the fighting, was laid to rest here. What of it? Records state that while its body was ruined, its engines burned bright, even as it was interred. It may not fly, but it might ram. A long shot, to say the least. Worth a try. Very well, then. Navigation systems are probably dead. We can't afford to miss. He's right. Someone will need to get close to the target and place a beacon. Our offensive launches in 90 minutes. The Emperor guide you, brothers. And you, sir. Using an ancient battle barge as a battering ram. An unorthodox approach. You disapprove. On the contrary, it is inspired thinking. I reluctantly second that. Why reluctantly? Because it will go to your head. by a report I have received from the Astra Telepathica. An accusation of heresy. Her voice was puppeted by her. The lieutenant will answer. The Psyker was possessed. Your sergeant believed otherwise. I was mistaken. You attempted to incapacitate your lieutenant. Thank the Emperor I failed. And now... The only individual capable of reaching Lord Kelgar is dead. By your hands, I will be watching all of you. Should I suspect even a flicker of corruption, I will not hesitate as you did. You are dismissed. to go. The enemy have amassed the majority of their forces in the Numerellian Basin. Talasa has the warp beacon. Viridian is hoping for a miracle. 
The rest of us will move to clear the reliquaries around the basin and establish a beachhead. We are facing overwhelming enemy numbers on Demerium, but the heretic filth down there have stirred the wrath of the Second Company. We will inflict upon the traitors such agony, the likes of which they have not seen since the burning of Prospero. They will suffer, they will break, and they will fall. Sons of Gilliman, for the glory of Ultramar! For the glory of Ultramar! Orbital drop without Gravis armor. It is brothers. Our captain's words need no further embellishment. I will speak only of practical concerns. The heretics will employ absolute deception. You will be assaulted by lies and illusion. The only true ground you will find down there will be each other. Trust only your brothers and your instincts. Now go forth and lay waste to our enemies. For the Emperor! For the Emperor! this before you mean drop through an active combat zone dodging flak enemy ships and burning wreckage on the way down exactly no this will be a first the codex astartes does not support this action but i am looking forward to it stay close it's almost impossible to regroup if we're separated 60 seconds helmets Sir! I must apologize for my actions on other House. Unnecessary. I fell prey to suspicion. Almost killed you. When I was a young captain, one of my men questioned my motives, brushed his concerns aside, and I paid the price. Your suspicions arose because I failed to answer your doubts. Stand by for suborbital drop. I'm honored to fight beside you both. As are we, brother. You grew up on Kalf. Let's say we settle some of that debt today. Why, sir? Focus.
control Aurora, the odds are not in our favor. Whatever it is, it is unsanctioned by the Adeptus Mechanicus. Put a stop to it. Yes, Captain. In Aurora! <laughs> you snatch in the air, cousins! We will soon find you in the flesh. And remove you from it. You may keep it as a parting gift. Painting this sacred ground with heretic blood gives me no pleasure. Rest easy, brother. These souls have long since reached the golden throne. Lieutenant Titus, praise the Omnisire. In just a few minutes, you will bear witness to- You must stop this! Sire, please. I know you have concerns, but look. This is merely a taste of what the device is capable of. And I have seen the worst of what it can do. My lord, you, you must trust me. This has, has been my quest for knowledge. My, my life's work. Shut it down. Now. I will not. Forgive me, Lord. Time will reveal the purity of my intentions. <laughs> you tiny grains of sand, prattling as you tumble. For a moment it seems you might do my work for me. But alas, I must finish this myself. With this true power! Thing. Enough of these childish games! Then let us put a stop to them once and for all!
Titus to Acheron. Do you read me? Damn it. How could that fool lose not have known? He took the whisperings of that sorcerer to be his own inspiration. Luz was merely a pawn. They killed Nozick. Led us to believe they would do the same to Luz. So we would deliver him precisely where they wanted him. And that spectacle in the catacombs. Deceit to trick that puppet Luz into finishing the work. This is worse than I could have imagined. That pillar floods the land with corruption. Titus to Acheron, come in! Fox is useless. We must find our brothers. Cadians! They are broken. Out! There's that monstrous obelisk. The screams a silent wail of corruption. Their human minds were not prepared for malign energies of this magnitude. Few are. Should we show them mercy? We must leave that to the Commissariat. We have more pressing duties. Nine years. Nine years. I'm receiving Nine a coded years. locator signal. Akaran signature. My eyes. Not the far from here. Does not Can we trust it? I believe so. Mark it on your space. With your breath. Yes, brother. Puppet of the arch enemy. We are now facing a warp rift the size of a small cruiser. Three volleys from the resilient and not a scratch on that pillar. If it has a weakness, I need to know what it is. It is powered by the artifact from Grya. If we can destroy that. Where is it? We do not know. You call that a solution? What is the alternative? There is a field around the pillar, impenetrable to our ordnance. We have observed their forces passing through it on foot. We must get close enough to see if we can do the same. Proceed through those doors. We make our assault imminently.
our forces are divided in two. I will lead the main assault from the Temple of Aethor. I sent two squads to move on the enemy's flank, but we have lost contact with them. They are carrying the company standard. If they have fallen, we will retrieve it, Captain. Ultramarines, ready! This is a burial world, Titus. If we fail to defeat the enemy, then I will burn this place. But I would prefer to not disgrace these honored dead. Can our scans locate the signature of the power source? We are blinded by all the interference. It is out there, at the heart of that profane madness. Agreed. One way or another, we must reach that obelisk. Then we shall. We hold this ground in the name of the Primark! If we die, we die with vengeance on our lips! And Central Obelisk appears to be the source of their power. It's protected by an energy field. Give me a solution. We've hit that shield with everything we've got. Nothing gets through. My lord! There may be a way. 
In the catacombs, Lou said all it took was a transference of alignment. And then he inverted something. An object. What of it? It was identical to that obelisk. You want to invert that? Explain. Your aura device might have a weakness. Might? Chapter Master. We cannot stay here. Lieutenant, you stand by Sergeant Gadriel's assessment. I do. Captain Agaran, must be your company. Aye, Chapter Master. Clamor for a taste of victory! But we will defy them this day, as we have defied them for ten millennia! We are the sons of Ultramar, servants to the Emperor and guardians of the Imperium. Let these wretches feel the wrath of ancient vengeance! are through the field. Hit them hard, Captain. Yes, Lord. All forces, fire at will. Handle the last one. I'll get them moving. Brief them over the box. Yes, Captain. Get to work.
Yes, my lord. was a trap. Perhaps. It's this. The Immaterium. If it is, we must move quickly. To where? We must find Kalgar. The changeless will is inescapable. Deeper we walk upon ancient paths, laid out for us before the first mortal true breath. Lord Kalgar left you to rot in the Death Watch for a century, Brother Titus. Coward! Cease cowering behind illusions! Make a bulwark of your hatred, brothers. Lord Calgar! Demons dog! 
Heretic! You die this day! This is my domain! You are here by my invitation! I am offering you a chance to kneel! Our chapter, sir, shall use your skull as a piss pot! this heretic. One last dance before the strings are cut. Brothers! Your pathetic companions are no more. You lie. You are no match for them, heretic. And so you deceive them. Your brothers buckle beneath the power of the war. Mere imitations. More trickery. Guard yourselves. Imura is weakening. That last fight will need you really. Stay together. We must find a way out. Over there. Something is happening. We should investigate. Watch your step. <laughs> Lord Kalga! Lord Kalga! My words to you on Thalassar. Speak them! My lord! Speak them, or be slain for an imposter. Rules should never make a prisoner of intelligence. Titus, it is good to see you. Their sorcerer's power wavers. He is vulnerable. See how his domain weakens as he does. There is only one place left for him to hide. Let us dig out the heretic. I see him, inside the stream. He prepares for another attack. It is the artifact, it must be. There is almost limitless power within that shard. Growing waves of 
of Gilliman. Brother, it is over. You did it. Brother! Titus, your decisive actions have saved this system from ruin. And so it is with great pride that I now present you with an honor worthy of your deeds. The laurels of victory. Let every warrior of the Adeptus Astartes see that here stands the true measure of a son of Gilliman. For the glory of Ultramar! Company dismissed. Forgive me, brother, that it took me so long to bring you home. My lord, that is... Fierce was my wrath when I learned of your detention. In their arrogant suspicion, the Inquisition failed to recognize the truth. That no evil will ever overcome a devotion such as yours. Thank you, my lord. There is a mission. It will take you away from the second company for a time. As you command, Chapter Master. The Brother Chaplain will brief you. It was he that suggested you for the task. My lord, the Sword of Kalth is ready to depart. Thank you, Captain. My ship will convey you to your destination. I shall be glad of your company. Titus. It has been an honor. It has indeed, my captain. I hear you'll be taking your leave of us. Not for too long, I hope. Emperor guide you. And you, sir. Brothers, I am called to serve elsewhere. You'll be missed, my lord. I will not forget the blood we have drawn together. Nor shall we. I owe you both a debt. You have restored my faith in brotherhood. We shall await your return. Courage and honor. Courage and honor. honor. Titus, Lord Kalgar has informed you of your assignment. Good. I will brief you en route. You are joining us. I am. Very good, my lord. You have done well. You have won the trust of your brothers. And of the chapter master. But know this, Titus. The stain of suspicion never completely fades. I will be watching you, should you falter on the path for even a moment. I will show 
no mercy. Leandros. My lord, it is time. <laughs> 